Here are three simple drills that you can do with the Swing XP bat. What you'd like to do is take five or six swings with your Swing XP bat, and then you're going to take five or six swings with your competition bat, or the bat that you're going to use in the game. And this is going to help you practice keeping your hands inside the ball. So the first drill we're going to do is just simply hitting the ball up the middle um, off your tanner tee. It's pretty simple. You're going to take five to six swings. Okay, make sure you finish your swing. Let's say we took five or six swings. You're going to pick up your competition bat, and you're going to take five or six swings. Okay. The next drill we're going to do with the Swing XP, I like to do with the youth, the youth model. Uh, it's called the one knee drill. We're going to make sure our back knee is on the ground, and our front foot is nice and extended. Uh, our front leg is nice and extended with our big toe pushing into the ground. Okay, we don't want to hit like this and hit open. We want to keep it closed, keep the, keep the big toe dug right into the ground. Okay, we're going to take, again, five swings with your Swing XP. Okay, push it up. Okay, and then five or six swings with your competition bat. I'd suggest choking up with your competition bat because we're isolating the upper body. You're not really able to use your hips so much. And that's the key. We want to work on our hand path to the ball, staying nice and short to the ball. For our third and last drill, I like to do the low and inside drill. What you need is a tanner tee short uh, so that you can set the tee up nice and low. No other tee really gets this low. You can set up nice and low, about knee high. You can see it's knee high, that's a strike. We're going to set it up a little bit out in front, okay, so that when I swing to hit this ball, it's going to help me keep my hands inside the ball. The majority of the weight of the Swing XP bat is right here in the hands. So that's going to help us keep our hands nice and close to our body and lead with the knob of the ball. Most kids, most youth hitters, they end up getting their hands out away from their body, and they're going to hit the outside of the ball and hit a little tapper to third or shortstop when they attack this pitch. Um, but we want us to keep our hands inside the ball. Again, we take five or six swings with the Swing XP and then five or six swings with your competition bat. If you've watched this video in its entirety, then I know you're serious about getting your game to the next level or your player's game to the next level. Until then, stay on playing.